The Transparency International Kenya has launched its 2017 to 2022 strategic plan, which will offer frameworks for use in the fight against corruption. This comes as the country is grappling with corruption cases that range from major corruption scandals to petty corruption. The report further seeks to engage citizen civil society organizations, the private sector, development partners and investors, as well as the government. The launch comes a week before the world marks the International Anti-Corruption Day. Please pick one as you head out. The new strategy is going to build on on this foundation that we have laid in the last five years. Despite these efforts that we have tried to do, corruption continues to shackle the development and potential of our country. We invest more in, in, in replicating models that have proven to work as a basis of acceleration and scale up of impact. Engagement with the academia, we will work more closely with knowledge institutions as part of strengthening research and evidence building and knowledge management capacity. I believe that corruption is something that prevents countries from realizing their full potential. When you look at Kenya, they came out a few weeks ago very positive news when it comes to the ease of doing business in Kenya. You can see that Kenya is climbing the charts and that businesses have an easier way of, of being established in, in Kenya. At the same time, Transparency International announced that Kenya has dropped six places and is now number 145 out of 176 countries in the, in the ranking that Transparency International, International Global is making every year. And this is, of course, a very great challenge.